so today I'm going to be showing you my everyday makeup. How I do it. How do I get this look? Seriously, how? How do I get it? I don't know. You have to watch this video to find out. So, let's get to this video, shall we? So as you see, I have no makeup on. This is me with no makeup. Do I look different? No? Yeah? Uh, but, um, so first I'm gonna, well, I can't find my primer, but the primer that I usually do use is called Baby Skin by Maybelline. So since I can't find that, and I'm sorry if I sound like a little hoarse, I don't know if I'm getting like sick or anything, but okay. So first I'm going to start with my eyebrows. I'm really like, I really sound sick. I don't know what's going on. Okay, okay. So I'm going to start with my eyebrows. I usually, you know, people usually start with like that foundation or something first, but I don't. Like, I do mine like totally backwards, but you can do yours, you know, however you want, whatever works for you. So, I do my eyebrow first, and I use my um, eyebrow brush, and I just use an eyeliner from my local beauty supply store. So, what I'm going to do first is, I hope you can see it, I don't know. So, if you see me, like, looking down, that's because I'm looking at a mirror. So, what I do is, so now I'm going to do my eyebrow. And now I'm going to brush it just to blend my eyebrow out. This is a good trick to make your eyebrow look, you know, as real as possible. If you have short eyebrows like me, because I have no eyebrow, it's like really short. So, this is what it looks like. Okay, so now I'm going to do my other side. And you have to create an arch. You want an arch in your eyebrow. You don't just want to create a straight eyebrow because you want it to look as real as possible. And you want it to make it look like you just got your eyebrows done. Even though I don't get my eyebrows done because I have no eyebrows. But I do shape my eyebrows up because my eyebrows is pretty wild. So I will pluck them or use a eyebrow razor. So yeah, and that's how easy I did my eyebrows. And basically, um, this is not really my everyday makeup routine. I usually just go out the house looking like this. This is my everyday YouTube routine. Um, well, not usually like all the time, but a lot of the times if I'm not really going away or I'm in a rush, this is what my makeup usually look like just like this but since we're I'm doing a video I might as well just you know do the makeup that I usually use in the video so now I'm gonna use this foundation by kiss New York oh it's dirty whatever who cares um yeah it's by kiss New York if you can see it, I don't know. Wait. This is what it looks like. It don't come as dirty as this, but, you know, you get the drift. So, now I'm just gonna put this on my forehead. Remember, I usually use primer, but since I don't have primer, I'm not going to use anything. Just pretend I have primer on my face. So I'm just going to rub, don't put this on your eyebrow. If you do your eyebrow first like I did, don't put this on your eyebrow because it's going to mess it up. So work your way around your eyebrow. And I put it on my eye. I put it under my eye. I don't use this on my whole face. Weird, I know. Okay? So I just use this for my forehead. 
I just use this for the top portion. I just use this for the top portion of my face. So, okay. Now, I'm going to use this. Now, I'm going to use Maybelline New York BB Cream. As you see. And the one that I have is called Deep Sheer Tint. As you can see, I don't know if you can see that, but it's deep sheer tint is the color that I have. Okay, and now I'm going to use my beauty blender for this. This is a new one, so that's why I look like weird. And I'm going to put this on my face. I don't know why I do my makeup like this, but um, yeah, I'm just going to do this. You don't need a lot. This is how much I got. And now I'm gonna just blend it out. Okay. <clears throat> this makeup routine is gonna be really big. I don't pick any makeup on my nose. Like, it's no need. Like, my nose is like, whatever. I just don't put nothing on it. So. I don't know if I should. Well, actually, my nose tends to get really shiny, so I really don't put anything on my nose. So, yeah, that's why. <clears throat> okay. So, now. Wow, I sound really sick. Like, really. I got makeup on my hands. Good thing I have a napkin. Now I'm going to do my eyes. And again, I use this same pencil. I actually really, really like this because um, it come out really dark. When I use this under my eye and, you know, instead of using the regular pencil. Oops, I got something in my eye. And just the makeup. Okay, so I like using this because as you can see, the tip of it, I'm going to write on my hand. Like, it come out pretty dark, but now I'm going to do the bottom of my eyelid. Remember, I'm looking at a, um, I'm looking at a mirror, so that's why I'm not looking at the camera. Okay, so as you can see, the difference. Well, you can see, but anyway. Okay, so now I'm gonna do my other side. Okay. I don't know why I always like this side better than this eye I have no idea but yeah this video is long I'm gonna have to cut this video down I'm already at 16 minutes so okay so now I'm gonna do my the wing the infamous I mean whatever now I'm gonna do the wing that I usually do. Okay, so I make a thin line in the corner of my eye and then make it thicker, but it's not gonna be too much thicker. It's still gonna be thin. Okay, once you get to the wing part, you wanna make it, you know, thicker. So, I don't know, but now, I'm going to take the wing and come down. Like that, okay? I don't know if I'm explaining this right. I don't know if I'm explaining this right, but I'm trying. 
to explain as good as possible. I meant as whatever. Okay. So. Yeah. I think I did this not as good as I usually do. I don't. I don't really like this. Maybe because I'm actually like trying to do this for the camera. That it didn't turn out as good as possible. But it turned out pretty good. Not as good as it usually be. And what I do is, in the corner of my eye, I just take a thin line and I bring it down to right here. As you can see. I don't know if you can see that. But that's what I usually do. I bring it down so my eye can be as chinky as possible. I like the chinky look. Okay, so this is the difference. This is the eye with makeup. This is the I mean this is the one with the wing. This is the one without the wing. So as you can see that I do have a slight, you know, chinky eye already, um, naturally. But this wing helped it even more. And people say, oh my gosh, like, I love your eyes. Your eyes are so chinky. <laughs> but it's not this like, you know, chink. I mean, it's not this chinky. Is that even a word, chinky? I have, I don't know if chinky is a word, but no, it is, I think. Okay, so now, I don't know, I don't do anything. Oh, I put on lip gloss, that's what I did. Okay, so I have this lip gloss by, oh, yeah, it's by Candies, and it's Cherry bomb and i actually got this for my birthday for um a gift <laughs> and it had a really pretty color um so yeah it looked like a reddish color i don't know but yeah that's it and that is my makeup and then I comb my hair after every time I you know when I finish doing makeup I usually comb my hair and that's it this is my makeup routine so oh and actually I do put makeup on my nose I forgot I do do that what I do is I take this LA girl Pro concealer, high definition, right here, and I just go down the my T zone. Oops. I hear like beauty gurus say like T zone, so this is the T zone. And but I am not a beauty guru, as you can see, and I go down like this. Okay. <laughs> oh, and this stuff you actually have to work like really fast because it dry out really fast. So this is what you do. Oh well, this is what I do. I just go down the middle of my nose. So thank you for watching this video. Make sure you like and subscribe and share this video with your friends. All you have to do is press that share button and share on your Twitter, Facebook, or whatever. Like you can just share the video. And subscribe press that red button down below or you can press this thing over here if you're watching it on YouTube or yeah okay so pink or purple requested this video so thank you pink or purple for requesting again another video and feel free to request videos like you guys can request videos I will most definitely do them okay so I want to do a shout out to Jalen Kate, thank you so much for subscribing and watching my videos. So, there go your shout out. And if anyone else would like a shout out, you could just ask me and I will most definitely do it. And remember, I have my email, my Twitter, and my Instagram in the description below. So, if you want to follow me or contact me, you most definitely can do that. 
And I also want to do a Q&A video. So I need like some questions. If you have any questions, if you're watching this video, video right now, like ask me some questions. So for the next video, if I when I reach up to 25 questions or 20 questions, when I reach up to 20 questions, then I will do the Q&A video. So if you guys have any questions for me, you know, my personal life, whatever, because I want you guys to get to know me a little bit more than me just like doing videos and like, oh, here you go video, there you are, blah, 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 whatever. So, and you can also do video requests. So if you have a video request, also put that in the, you know, comment section below. So like this video, subscribe, share with your friends, and yeah, see you next time. Just give me you, just give me you, that's all I wanna do And if what they say is true, if it's true, I'ma give it to you I may take a lot of stuff, guaranteed, I can back it up